Assalamu alaikum ninjas, welcome back, welcome back, peace be upon you and it's time to release this video, oh my god I waited so long, many of you are waiting for this uh, long awaited video and uh, many of you voted uh, for yes, please make sure to publish the debunk video regarding the Mr. Who's the Boss video and his own statement, what he said, oh my god, he basically said that the gaming smartphones shouldn't exist on the market, which is again hypocritical from him, I saw that he was promoting I think Black Shark uh, like a month ago uh, before he made this video so what the heck he's doing man he's not the only person man all the famous youtubers do have this tactic where they basically first earn money promoting some smartphones then later on a few months later they would make some drama regarding some smartphone to attract some views or something like that without doing some homework or basically just behind the mask man I complete this hypocritical man honestly it's hypocritical so ninjas I'm gonna use Pocophone F1 versus Black Shark to give you a proof which I already said a few weeks ago and I, I wanted to do this video a few weeks ago but I couldn't manage it because I was waiting for the Xiaomi to release Android 9 Pi for the Black Shark they didn't yet in, uh, release it so Black Shark is still on Android 8 I know I know completely unfair because the Pocophone F1 is on an Android 9 Pi with the new up, updated GPU drivers so this is not 100% reliable and correct comparison you just have that in mind but it's gonna be interested interesting even if the black shark has android 8 this video will be super interesting so please make sure to watch it till the end ninjas and you will be you will, you will be you will see you will see it ninjas just stay so uh, anyway i want to appoint this uh, the uh, intro will be super long but i'm gonna give you a timeline where the actual comparison starts so please make sure to listen to me you probably uh, if you are really a true uh uh, op optimist and positive guy who wants to know the true facts real uh, information then you're probably gonna listen to me uh, anyway um, what I'm gonna complain here uh, regarding the mister who's the boss and uh, honestly who's the boss the boss he's the boss we should just uh, lay a red carpet in front of his house whenever he comes out man what the hell who names himself a boss man what an artist dude anyway uh, so ninjas what I want to say here his points basically he made a video saying something such such a huge thing to say uh, this kind of a smartphone category shouldn't exist uh, uh, without giving any proof ninjas he was just basically puking some information so it's like a, he, he was puking some informations uh, like some pictures random informations without actually doing some gameplays actual gameplays with between like four or five ten different smartphones something like that he is famous he could just basically easily put ten different smartphones on a table and do gaming comparisons etc uh, etc et and just and he basically he does a video i don't know maybe two videos a week or three videos a week and even there man he has a lot of of free space there to do his homework and to investigate everything and you know ninjas i myself that i create videos every day like five of them i don't have enough time to do like a proper kind of free time like them have imagine if i have a week a full week to do just one single video for one video for one smartphone Oh my god, bro. Oh my god. I'll be like the Doctor Who, the Einstein of, <laughs> of the smartphone informations. But I can't do, I don't have free time, that enough of free time to do uh, that, something like that. I hope in the future I will have it, ninjas, but right now. And in that way, maybe I do spend less time on one single smartphone and I test different smartphones. But, uh, smartphones. but in that way, ninjas, since I do test so many different things on one single smartphone or on, on different smartphones, I exactly know how they behave and what they are giving and what they do and how they perform so i will show you in this video that and also mr who's the boss what the heck man uh he's not the only person who said that, that the, uh, the gaming smartphones are gimmicky he's not the only person so don't be like that other you, famous youtubers said something like that which is again completely childish thing to do without doing a proper test gaming comparison test but you, uh, what I want to say that you can't put in the basket the gaming device with the other smartphones like casual smartphones like what well, I don't know maybe Honor Play or I don't know Xiaomi Mi Mix 3, OnePlus 6 uh, they are casual smartphones uh, and uh, they have the price tag and they offer what they offer for the price ninjas and the, why would you say that the gaming smartphones shouldn't exist even if they have the same performance they do have a different features which example I can compare the Pocophone and Black Shark po Black Shark does have different features with which Pocophone doesn't have ninjas remember that one of the biggest and what what uh, many uh, gamers would love to have on the gaming device is the dual speakers super deep bass which is again out of the, this world uh, probably the best uh, sounded audio gaming device under $500 it is the black shark ninjas it's 
Absolutely gorgeous to listen anything on this device, ninjas. Left and right, mono. Uh, stereo, sorry for that one. Uh, anyway, so if we say that gaming devices shouldn't exist, then basically we should say that uh, smartphones with 360 degrees camera shouldn't exist. Smartphones which do have projectors. Remember that there is a special category of smartphones which do also have some really cool features as a projector. Because people, uh, companies create these smartphones because they're tar targeting a special community, a special group of people who do love to have these features. Maybe they are the same price tag as some really casual smartphones which do look better and have a better display or something like that, but people don't care for the design or a display. They want to have these features. They, they, want, well, they want to have it, Ninjas. They want to have it. They want to have a special gaming uh, gamepad uh, which is uh, uh, basically specially exclusively made for this device. They want to have example a projector they want to have a, a camera 360 camera there are some also i saw you cool really cool smartphones which do have also 360 degrees vr cameras they can record vr videos in just in reality which is really insane so by that logic saying that the gaming smartphones shouldn't exist then i in the, with that logic actually i should say that smartphones with the projectors shouldn't exist i could just buy a projector smartphones with the vr camera shouldn't exist i could just buy a vr and you know carry two three things in the same basket in the same <laughs> in the same uh, luggage or something like that what the heck man why why they shouldn't exist man i want to have on one smartphone many many cool features not uh, not having a two or three devices in the same time to carry with myself to be useful useful for me man I want to have everything with one example if somebody is working like a in a uh, in a business field and he wants to have a projector with his smartphone he can just project a presentation with one single smartphone remember that in just I'm, I'm gonna even leave in the description that kind of uh, that kind of smartphone or VR I don't have a VR camera and I don't want to spend additional money for just to, to have a special uh, another additional item in my bag to have a VR camera when I can have it with a smartphone imagine that man I mean just sorry for this long intro I just want to debunk all those statements and i'm really uh, kind of annoyed that uh, mr who's the boss made that kind of crucial video without showing any proof he didn't show show anything man he was just basically showing his face and some random some kind of random half facts or something like that again i repeat that in that video something something there is true and i do agree with some points but the main thing which he said that the gaming software shouldn't exist that's completely utterly bollocks man Honestly, bollocks. So let's begin with this video. Sorry again with this uh, for this long video, but I want to share uh, uh, all these things and this thing. This topic is crucial, and I could I could talk about it like a full day now. Now, anyway, let's begin, bro.
Damn man, it's laggier than the Black Shark. Black Shark it's way way better. You judge by yourself ninjas, but honestly, Black Shark runs this game better man. In the shark mood. It's very laggy here on the on the Poc phone F1 at the same settings ninja, same processor, Snapdragon 845. And Black Shark has an old Android 8. Old GPU drivers, bro. Versus Pokemon F1 having Android 9 Pi, new GPU drivers.